What is going on, SKF here, and welcome to an informed Ben Yetter player review. So he's got an 85 rated card. He also has a ones to watch card. Of course, he transferred from Sevilla to AS Monaco. So you can make some pretty interesting teams. You know, he is, like I said, in the French League and League 1. So you can, of course, link him to Mbappe or Gelson Martins. But yeah, he's got a nice card. Not as OP as last year. As you guys all know, that card, his uh, special cards from last year were very good. His finesse shots were insane. So, yeah, his card looks fantastic this year, but nowhere as good as, of course, FIFA 19. So he's got 86 pace, 85 shooting, 79 passing, 87 dribbling, 63 physicality, and, of course, the five-star weak foot, four-star skill moves. You can see here the team we used him in. Pretty standard league on team, and, uh, yeah, nothing too special, but this guy is very expensive. You could see I bought him for around 160K, and he went up to around 210k on Xbox, 280k on PlayStation, and he is 300k on PC. So, very expensive card, but it is, of course, an insane card. Ben Yedder, of course, you know, is always good in FIFA. So, he's got 90 acceleration, 82 sprint speed. He, I mean, you know, that's pretty standard. You know, he excels pretty quickly. And, uh, yeah, he's got some good speed on him. It's really the attack positioning. He has 92 attack positioning and he makes really good runs through on the defensive line so that's really key and once he's through you know that he has enough pace to uh get past them you can see a nice run again from ben Yedder. you can see kind of just fits through that hole and uh finishes this very nicely he also has 91 finishing so he's very good inside the box very clinical and uh, is able to score his chances 83 shot power 86 volleys as well you know pretty good stats to have and uh yeah passings 82 vision 82 short pass he's very good at distributing the ball you can honestly play him at cam i mean he does have 70 stamina and his work rates you know he's got high high probably doesn't suit that but he could play that role you know he distributes the ball pretty well holds the play up very well as well so i mean overall he's just a great all-around striker he has everything dribbling you know on the ball he's really good four star skills 92 agility because he is five foot seven to so he feels really good on the ball 84 reactions 85 uh 85 ball control 87 dribbling and 85 composure i mean all of those stats are excellent so you know he's just an all-around great striker he's capable of you know scoring creating dribbling and he has a pretty good pace so i mean overall it's just a fantastic card the only cons i got from him of course are his 60 strength and 70 stamina but i mean overall it's a very enjoyable card very fun card not as good as last year, but definitely one of the top strikers in the game at the moment. And, of course, gets that link, that strong link to Mbappe. So, yeah, uh, for the price, I don't think it's too bad. I mean, if you can pick him up for a little cheaper, that obviously be great. But it's not a bad price for Ben Yedder. But, uh, yeah, I'll give him a 9 out of 10. Very enjoyable, very solid card. And, yeah, that's going to be my review. Please like the video. Of course, comment down below who you want to see next. We got some uh, scream cards. And, of course, thank you for watching.